Rapoki, no, no, no. Lapoki, yes, yes, yes. So there's this all girls high school right near our house. And right when it approaches around three or four, you see like groups of girls going to our local uh, punchik chip, which is like fast gourmet food in Korea. And they order plates of rapoki. And it's not the most healthiest thing. It's a mix of ramyeon and tteokbokki. But it's, uh, it's really good. It's a nice snack. It gets you spicy, it gets the energy going, and uh, a nice way to finish the day, if you're young. Uh, four fresh ingredients we're gonna put in. Uh, of course, the ramen a little bit later. All right, the first one is rice cake, and this is the one we used to make tteokbokki. And uh, this one looks so cute. You can actually eat this straight. Mm. Well, it doesn't really have a real taste. It's just that chewing texture. One thing, if you buy duck from the supermarket, you wanna eat uh, all of it in the same day, or else it starts getting very hard. Today, we're gonna do a two-person portion, and I'm gonna separate them and fill up enough to fill one cup. And next, I have some Korean omuk or odeng. And I'm gonna just cut this up into small pieces, bite-sized pieces, and that's roughly more or less one cup. So if you haven't visited Asia before, fish cake may seem like an odd ingredient. Uh, it's like the meatball to see, but we love it over here. But you can replace it with like some ham or slice up some sausage as well. Fourth of an onion, slices. And then of course, a foreign piece of spring onion. All right, and the last thing, we need some noodles. So I'm gonna use the shin ramen. Uh, but we're not going to use the packets. And then, of course, the best part about lapoki is the boiled egg. You know, we all look at each other, trying to see who's going to reach for the last one. So today we'll do two. And no need to get fancy schmancy, like half runny yolk egg, half... No, just hard boil them. <laughs> all right, and let's make this lapoki. We're going to put our fish cakes in, and then our duck, the rice cake. We'll just put that in. And then we're going to put in two cups of water. That's one. And that's two. All right, first thing we're gonna do is add one tablespoon of sugar, add some sweetness, and then I'm gonna add one tablespoon of honey. If you're out of honey, it's okay. Just use two tablespoons of sugar. And then we're gonna put this on a medium high heat. The water's gonna boil and the sugars will melt. And then that sweet base is going to soak in all of the other spicy seasoning. Once it starts to come up to boil, two tablespoons of soy sauce. That's one, two. We're gonna do one tablespoon of gochujang. Then one and a half tablespoons of gochugaru, Korean red chili pepper flakes, and that's another half. Then I'm gonna add in the onions. And then finally, our ramen, yes. All right, and then we're gonna give it a few minutes for the ramen to cook through. And then our eggs, just drop them in so they get colored as well. These noodles are gonna soak up a lot of the liquid. And lapoki is not supposed to have that much liquid, just a little bit of base. And guys, I think we're done. Scoop out a lot of the, a lot of the rice cakes on top. And then we're gonna just put some spring onions over the top. All right, and guys, here it is. Take a nice look. We have the ramens and the tteokbokki. Get some of the noodles here. Get a little bit of the tteok, the rice cakes here on top. And then let's dig in. Wow, that's delicious, guys. Oh, and then let's get one of the eggs. All right. And then this is an ancient tradition. Yes, dab it. Dab it, dab it, yes. Tteokbokki for you. Mm. Mm. More than anything else, I love the balance in spiciness and a little bit of sweetness here. Um, there's some shops in Seoul, I don't know what they put inside, but it just blows your socks off. So you'll walk in with a dry shirt and you'll walk out like, like a sauna. I mean, it's just damp and that's nasty. So I really like the balance here. If you like tteokbokki, try this recipe out. And uh, I think you're gonna really like it. I just talked for too long. I can already look at the noodles and uh, they're looking soggy already. They soaked in all the sauce. They're purasa. Um... 